Let's take a birthday photo. Come on, the girl who balls her eyes out. Stop it. That's my girlfriend, and she's crying because her birthday's in just a couple days, and I'm gonna miss it. Well, she thinks I'm gonna miss her birthday. So today, I'm gonna do what she never thought I could. Today, I am traveling over a thousand miles to surprise my girlfriend on her birthday. This is K-Cup. She's my girlfriend. She's the girl who taught me that life is more than just a blur of busy work. She showed me what real, worth fighting for kind of love looks like and how it feels to truly be alive. It feels like yesterday, but it was two years ago that we were in New York and I gave that girl a promise ring that said, I'm not going anywhere. I can still see New York and I, I remember how it felt. I remember how it smelled. I remember the look in her eyes when I gave her the promise ring and the peace that it gave her when I told her I wasn't going anywhere. And now I'm on the road. Right now I'm on tour with Maverick City. I actually think this is the longest we've ever been separated. I can still see the sadness from the look in her eyes. You see, as long as I've been dating my girlfriend, she has always thought I'm incapable of actually surprising her. No, seriously, think of an example of when you actually surprise. No, There's no reason to ball your eyes out. I want you there on my birthday. I'm, I want to be there on your birthday. I don't want to Zoom call you. I know you don't. I know you want me to be there. But you got to trust me, bro. Do you trust me? No one. No, you, 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 you don't trust me with your birthday. No. <laughs> oh my gosh. God dang. I just want you. I hate Tor. I'm happy for you, but I don't like it. I know. It broke me looking at her directly in the eyes and saying, I'm sorry, but this time I can't give you what you want. But that ring that she wears, it's more than just a present. It's more than just a ring. It's a promise. I even wrote a song about it. It's called I'm Not Going Anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Anywhere. But today is a good day. I'm traveling over a thousand miles to go surprise her on her birthday at Disney today. And she has no idea. I'm not exactly sure how I'm gonna do it yet. I thought about buying an entire Mickey suit so I could like take a picture with her before she knew it was me. Apparently they don't allow that at Disney. I can understand why. Nevertheless, I am traveling back home over a thousand miles and I do have some tricks up my sleeve. So we should probably knock some of those out before I leave. Let's go. It's been about six hours. I changed my shirt. I performed my last show. I actually got some really sad text messages from her just a couple minutes ago and I can feel that and so I'm actually getting really excited because like she has no idea I'm coming. She knows I go live in this bus every single night so I'm gonna go live on TikTok tonight for a while before I leave for my hotel to get to my hotel to take off at 5 a.m. tomorrow to be in Orlando. Hello? Hey there. Are you on the tour bus? Uh, yes. I'm coming over to them right now. I'll be there in 30 seconds. Oh, there you are. Turn to your left. Oh my gosh, you don't understand. You just saved the day. They didn't have the Thank exact you. one that you wanted, but... No, this is perfect. Right. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Have a good one. Okay, so... This is an iPhone charger. I have a second iPhone that I'm gonna set up with my location and plug into the Wi-Fi here in the bus so that while I'm traveling back to Orlando, K-Cup will think that I'm still traveling in the bus. So she like will literally see my location going with the tour, but secretly I'll be on the way to surprise her in Orlando. So I just went live with K-Cup, I came inside. I'm telling you guys, this girl is so nosy. I had to go live with her as much as she wanted me to. That's why I battled her like six times. I celebrated her birthday with her at midnight on live stream and now I'm gonna call her because she just got off. I have to do this as if I was staying here. But even like being in front of these lights right now, I'm afraid that if it looks too much like I'm like, you know, setting up for like a vlog camera or something that like she's gonna know. So I have to play it really chill. Hello? Hey, happy birthday. I love you so much. Thanks so much. Love you so much. I'm sorry you're sad. Do you want to FaceTime me? <laughs> happy birthday to you. Wait, I wanna see you. Wow, it's beautiful. Let me see you. That's my 26 year old girlfriend right there. Yeah. Where are you? I'm just in the dressing room because no one's in it. So I was just, I almost wanted to step away so I can say hi. So what are your plans for tomorrow? Like, are you guys gonna have some fun? Yeah, but I don't wanna talk about it. Why not? I just don't wanna talk about it. Okay, let me see you. Okay, go. I love you so much. For real. And I can't wait to see you soon, okay? 
when we yeah. do get to when we do get to celebrate it, we're gonna freaking kill it, and we're gonna make it worthwhile. Okay? Yeah. I love you so much. Send it to you, bye. Why are you leaving me so, so fast? Because I just don't want to cry, and I'm with my friends. Okay, love you so much. Bye. Y'all got about ten more minutes, man. Perfect. We've secured the bag. We've that actually broke my heart a little bit because like. K Cup, can I just say to you right now, it is your stubborn butt saying that you've never been surprised that made me have to prove it to you once that I know how to surprise you. I love you so much, K Cup. I was wanting to say goodnight. I'm gonna fall asleep here in a second. So I just want to say, dear Lord, I pray for K Cup. I want her to have a happy birthday. I pray that she wakes up with a great attitude and she has an amazing day and that she knows I'm thinking about her and praying for her and that she has so much fun with her friends at Disney and that she FaceTimes me a ton after my rehearsal in the morning. God, I pray for you uh, just to, to move through her. And God, thank you so much for the way you're going me in this season. I can't wait to see what you do this next in Jesus' name. Amen. Kick up, I love you so much. And we're going to celebrate your birthday so soon. I'm just, it broke my heart to see you come. And obviously, I'm going to make, make it so special for you when you get to hang out. I love you, sweet dreams. And I hope that you know I love you so much. Seriously. Have an amazing day tomorrow. We made it to the airport. It's three o'clock in the morning. Let's get on our flight. We made it to Orlando. I'm with my friend. What's up, guys? This is Manny. He's all, all incognito. He's wearing his. Uh, We're ninja out. He's ninja out. He is going to be our cameraman today, so that we can really get this done. I don't want to give away too much of what we're doing today, but we have an entire game plan. And we need to go. It's the middle of the day. Yeah. First thing we gotta do though is I gotta send this video. So hold on a second. So I made her a video on the bus yesterday so that she'd think I was there. Currently my phone says that I'm in Evans, Georgia. Happy birthday, kick up. I love you so much. Yeah, this is it. Uh, I'm just chilling on the bus by myself because everyone just like left. Mm -hmm. And I'm sorry to say it, but I do have some bad news to tell you. I did pick my face this morning. <laughs> <laughs> I, I threw that in there because I wanted so her to think that though. this was, you know what I mean? Yeah. You'd never say that on add, a vlog. Add the little things. We're gonna, I'm going to tell you on the day, like, this is your birthday, and we're celebrating it together, and, and like, we're going to have so much fun, and I love you so much, and I love you so much, and I'll be talking to you, texting you today, and stuff like that, but I just wanted to be early morning texting you and telling you that I love you so much. Boom. All right. I'm gonna send I believe you're on the bus right now. For sure. <laughs> okay. I'm going to send this video to her and hopefully like, bro, we've gotten so far. I don't want to spoil it. I'm getting nervous, bro. Bro, <laughs> she's at Disney right now. All we have to do is not be seen. So let's get going. Okay. This is good news. This is good news. But right before we left, k up texting me back. I thought you were coming. Your location was off all night. So I tricked myself. Love you so much. Have a great day. Bro, she's buying it, bro. dude. She is locked. She has no idea because at the top now on like iPhones, it says like she's in Bay Lake. On mine, it literally says Evan. Go check your phone right now. Check your phone. It'll say I'm in Evans, Georgia, right now. I you I don't oh have your yeah, he, he hasn't updated his phone. He's, uh, what I have my my phone's updated. I just don't think you're sharing uh, location. About with me. Oh, I don't know you like that. I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're on the ferry over right now, and on the way over there, I'm gonna post something on my Instagram story that says that I'm in Evans, Georgia. And I wanna, let me just say like really quick, I, I formally apologize to anybody who's watching this YouTube video right now who is in Evans, Georgia at this concert. Look at this story. I understand that I could cause some unnecessary confusion while posting this because none of you guys know currently like in the moment that like I'm doing this. So I just wanna apologize for anybody who's going to the Evans, Georgia concert that I wasn't there because as you can see, I'm not 
but I think it's all going to be worth it. I think it's all going to be worth it. And I promise I'll come back to Evans, Georgia, and I will give you guys a good concert, okay? We're going we're gonna to make a Georgia concert happen soon. But I do have one more thing to post. It's this photo I worked up last night. I worked really hard on it so that, like, today I wouldn't have to put too much energy into it. It's a photo of me and K-Cup. I, like, really, I really built out this entire, like, this entire paragraph just talking about K-Cup. I really wanted it to be special, and so, like, I put a lot of time and effort into, like, what I was saying, but it's essentially, like, us last year at Christmas, us in Hawaii, a funny photo, you know what I mean, gotta, gotta be real. This photo was taken one of the first times we ever hung out. You can see how young we look, it's freaking nuts. And that was last year, today. One year ago today, we were in New York, right where her dad's memorial is. And then I said in the caption, you guys can go read this on Instagram yourself, but essentially that she's one of a kind. And then I thank God that she walked into that little Baptist church when we met three years ago. So I put a lot of effort into this and I'm gonna post it to let her know how much that she means to me from afar. At the bottom of this, I even put happy birthday and I'm so excited to celebrate with you as soon as I'm home from tour. That's the vibe. So let's post it. Boom, it's live. K-Cup, we are outside Disney, and we are coming for you right now. Watch out. No, once we step over this line on the bridge, it's game on. We can't oh. make any mistakes, bro. No mistakes, bro. No right, mistakes. right when your foot goes over it, bro. Oh, it's game time. Now we are in Magic Kingdom, and K-Cup is literally across this little gateway. Like, she's right over there. It looks like to me like she's right by the castle, so we're going to try and head over by where she is without her seeing us. I feel like she could be anywhere, though. Like, there's so many people here today, you know what I mean? And they just decorated for Christmas, so everybody is here right now. This is freaking nuts. What I really love is that these Mickey ears, like she would never expect us in these. They're like a great disguise, don't you think? This is the equivalent of a mustache. I freaking love that we have, like she was, she'd never see, this was a great purchase. Man, no, we, it's freaking throwing, I thought we were done with them. <laughs> no. So after Minnie tried to throw away our disguises, we thought like what better thing could we do than like try to give these ears to somebody who didn't have them. We thought we were doing like a goodness to humanity. Anyways, this is what happened. Do you guys want some Mickey ears? We're not gonna use them anymore. No, thank you. Okay. Maybe we should trash them. <laughs> Actually, no. That sketches me out. You creep. <laughs> Do you guys want Mickey ears? Oh. Yeah, you guys want some Mickey ears? Oh my gosh, thank you. No problem. Thank you so much. She's like 50 feet away from us right now. We stepped inside a building so we could watch them walk past us. Like, they have no idea we're here. K Cup is completely sold that we're not here. Okay, this is our chance to get a little closer. Let's go. Yeah. That was wild. Oh my gosh. No wonder people like being spies. <laughs> my adrenaline's through the roof. Oh, they're gonna come, come back up. Yeah, yeah, we gotta get out here. The first thing we wanted to do was buy her ice cream and like not tell her it was us. Like we wanted to go all over the park before her so that she'd just walk into places and people would just give her things. That, that's the exit. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. Can you hear me? Hey, Emmy. No, it's Kelty. Oh, Kelty, when you guys get off the ride, Right up to the left, there's a little stand where you can get ice cream. Go to the stand and tell them it's K-Cup's birthday and they're gonna give you free ice cream, okay? Okay, cool, we'll do that. So I you... hope you're wearing a disguise or something. I'm trying to wear my best disguise I can. See you in a second. All right, we're getting off. All right, bye. Okay, bye. Can I get an ice cream, pay for it, but then it's for the girl that's getting off the ride right now. It's her birthday. They're gonna come over here and tell you it's her birthday. That's how you'll know. Okay, I'm gonna get the, the, the number one. Yeah. Really? You got it covered? Wow. Oh no, I want her to come get it. Did you just act like you're giving it to her? Okay, I told him. I'll tell him right now. Thanks. Wow, that was so kind of you. Oh my gosh. Now, we wait. Do you see her? No. So at this point, we were really confused. Like we got in contact with Emmy and Kelsey and they kind of explained what happened. We were trying to assess our plan and we were ready to up the ante. So we were all over the place. Oh, they're moving forward. I see him, I see him. Okay. Oh, that's it. No, let's go, let's go. I mean, we were in the back of her photos. Oh my gosh, I'm like 10 feet behind her right now. 
I'm not kidding when I say this was one of the funnest and most stressful days. Literally, an entire month's worth of planning was on the line in this moment. She's like looking intently at her photos right now. She's like, stop. She literally stopped. Oh no, <laughs> did we just get caught? And if we got caught, it was all over. Every plane, every bus, every Uber, every person that coordinated, it was all on the line if we got caught. If she turns around, it's because we're caught. What's really funny is the fact that like, we're here, right, looking at her location, but she still thinks I'm in Evans, Georgia. Look at this. That is my phone in Evans, Georgia, moving on a tour bus right now because I used my secondary, like my old phone, and put my location on it, bro. This is genius. I cannot believe she fell for this. Well, I actually can. This is genius. Manny, are you okay, bro? Yeah, I just kind of want the Mickey Mouse ears back, bro. At one point, we actually had a Disney worker take our camera and try to film her for us. So, this is what she looks like, okay. and this is what he looks like. Okay, okay. Wow, so I have to get cool. All right, we're on the same page. Let's get this up. Okay, she's got to be coming out any second right now. Oh man, I don't see her yet. I don't see her yet. I don't see her yet. There they are. She's over here. Over here. Over there. Dude, I think he's going to get a good shot. Oh, they're coming, they're coming, they're, they're coming, coming, they're coming, they're coming. Is he gonna get it? Oh, they're right there, they're right there. Bro, I, if she didn't see me, I was staring right at her, bro. That was nuts. I hate to say it, but this is where things went south because my location for her was like 30 seconds delayed and I didn't know it, but she had turned around. And so while we were walking towards her, her friends noticed us walking towards them. And then K-Cup caught my eye. And I quickly turned around and tried to get away from her before she saw me. But uh, <laughs> I didn't even get to film her reaction from my angle. Luckily, her friends were filming because they saw us and they knew it was coming. So it, this is how it happened. No! All right, they're coming back, they're coming back, they're coming back. I don't know, I don't know why they're coming back. She caught us. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. King, I had like two more things to do before I showed you. The reason I wanted to say an ice cream one is because he bought you I an bought you an ice cream. cream. She's been mad at me for four You guys didn't get the ice cream? Jacob, how do you feel right now? <laughs> I've been bought my eyes all day. What? Oh. Wait a minute. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it the whole time. I knew you did how not. Did your Georgia. <laughs> we got her so good. Let's go. Wait, 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 wait. I knew it. I knew you were being sus. I knew you were being sus. I knew that she was being sus all day. I was gaslighting myself saying, <laughs> I know he's here. I just have a feeling. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Dude, I asked her how her spidey senses work with you. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. And everyone's texting so weird. Everyone? And then when, yes. Like who? You, you did that! <laughs> Emmy was my... Emmy and Kelty were both in on this with me, very much so. I knew it since yesterday! You knew it since Come yesterday? I, was, like, I woke up, I said, wow, no, his location's been off. Like, he really didn't come. She didn't I know. She, she had no know. idea. Yeah, she, she didn't know. Genius. Genius. Oh, yeah, look, look at the photos. We thought that's when you caught us. We took... Do you see it? <laughs> <laughs> Back of every photo, bro. <laughs> As you can tell, I am very much capable of surprising. My phone is on Do Not Disturb. My phone was on Do Not Disturb. Oh, he's mad at me. I know I got you. How did you get here? I'm literally shaking. 
I booked an Airbnb last night and then took a flight this morning at like three in the morning and then And they let you you're not performing today? No, I'm missing today so I can be here. And you you told I and I said I really know he's not coming because he told all of Georgia that he's gonna be there. So he I was literally thinking about that. Well we were in there. I knew that story would get you. And Tiff just texted me, we'll have to celebrate soon. Me and Noah will celebrate with you soon. Oh she's so good. She's so good. That's amazing. There's so many little things that have been happening today. So you admit it, I'm capable of tricking you. Like I got you good today. But I did a little no, bit. No, 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 no way. Not even. Be honest, tell people, were you completely surprised? Yes! Yes! yes. How did you guys see us? What did you time, see? The first time I saw you and Emmanuel was when we were getting off. I saw you guys leaning over the edge while we were on the cars. Oh, on the cars! And I said to Emmy, I said, they're right there. So oh my god. the whole time on that? Yeah, we saw everything. Hey, Can we take a second to look at what part of the park we got caught in? Literally oh, in a car. Oh, wow. Yeah. I was looking at him through the bushes. I was like, I, I see him. Walking back this way, I turned around to look at Kay, and I saw. <laughs> you knew from the moment you packed your vlog camera. I what? said in the back of my head when you packed that, when you were leaving, I said, is he surprising me? I promise. It's the little things, bro. Or like last night when I was live, did you notice that I like turned the camera towards Rue? My vlog camera was on the live stream for a second. Don't even. That's Keiko. Oh no, but I did hear you packing your bag last night. I heard you zipping your bag, oh, and I was like, man. is he coming here? I feel like that could have been my backpack, though. I didn't even check a bag. No, that's what in my head, though. All week. Yeah, you were gaslighting the last yourself. two days, I've been gaslighting myself <laughs> all day. Cake up, you are so worth every single mile. How did, wait, how, when did they approve you? When? Yeah, when did they approve it? Uh, they approved it out the gate. They had no problem with me leaving. So this whole time <laughs> you've been doing that? No. Wait, go ahead. No. <laughs> Let's take a birthday photo. Come on, the girl who balls her eyes out. Stop it. <laughs> you know, I would travel across the world to be with you on your birthday. I can't believe this. This is the best birthday <laughs> ever. For real? You think so? It beats last year? I love okay, you so we much. Gotta go on rides. All right, let's go on some rides. Let's go do it. A memory, a moment that lives on captured in Remember Whens and I Can't Believe Wees. It's a shared understanding where for a moment, hearts are paralleled and beat and the emotions come flooding back from where they were hidden in our minds. That's my girl. All I want is a lifetime of Remember Whens with her. Am I crazy to believe a moment isn't a memory unless it's shared? To find an opportunity to make her smile and to get to be there for her is the equivalent of 60 year old me getting to roll over in bed and say, remember when? One more time. To miss out on showing her the kind of love that she always wanted to believe existed isn't an option. I feel lucky to know that I'm the guy that she's trusted with that. It's bittersweet. In my head I know the morning will come and I'll have to leave for tour again, leaving her until the next time. And before we know it, our Christmas season will come to an end. But in that, this memory will live forever. Making this audio message, I'm back on the road. It's like that day was just a dream. And here I am back on the tour bus in Omaha, Nebraska. Cake up if you're watching this, and I know you are because you secretly watch all my vlogs. <laughs> I miss you so much. And I loved that memory so much. And I'm excited to make more memories in Breckenridge. And I'm excited to share those memories on the vlog. I have your present. I'm excited to share that on the next vlog too. And maybe what I'm most excited for is to get you back for good. I'm sick of you being gone all the time. Oh my gosh. Let's see if we can change that.